Envision a layer of varnish painted on a globe. Relative to the size of the Earth, that layer mirrors the thinness of the atmosphere. It is made up of layers of gases such as oxygen, carbon dioxide, and ozone, which all support animal and plant life in a variety of ways. For example, ozone protects us from harmful UV radiation, and we need oxygen to support our life systems just as plants require carbon dioxide to support theirs. The hydrosphere contains all the salt water and fresh water on, under, or above the surface of Earth. Fresh water exists in a fixed amount in a hydrologic cycle. Evaporation, condensation, precipitation, runoff, and groundwater. Saltwater oceans provide an essential service to Earth as the main drivers of weather and as critical sinks that absorb carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. The biosphere contains all terrestrial ecosystems and may be referred to as the zone of life. It includes all soil, plants, and animals, or what we refer to as biomass. Essentially, wherever organisms survive is part of the biosphere, whether at land, at sea, or in the air. Beneath the biosphere is the lithosphere, including oceanic and continental crust, as well as the geosphere, which is Earth's inner core. Since the Iron Age, the lithosphere has been central to human development, providing ores for metalwork. Today, we mine and drill the lithosphere for fossil fuels such as coal and petroleum to drive modern industry. For example, petroleum has several commercial and industrial uses. We package our food and other goods with plastic, wear nylon clothing, and feed oil not only to our cars, but to our crops in the form of petroleum-derived fertilizers.